friends, welcome back to our channel if you've seen our videos before and if you're new, my name is Abby. My name is Hope. And we're the, the Disney, Disney sisters. sisters. Today we are doing a massive haul for you guys in true Disney Sisters fashion. We are bringing it back and it is the Vera Bradley haul. In true Disney Sisters fashion, we bought too much Vera Bradley stuff. There's a lot. There's a lot of bags around us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Here we are. And we have been putting off doing this video for quite some time now. If you are up on the Disney Vera Bradley action, you know that both of these um, have launched within the last few months. But as you also may know, if you saw our update video, which we will link up above the video where we updated all of you, um, our life has been a little crazy lately and we have not uh, been able to yeah. sit down and film either of these, any of these videos. So we just decided we'd put them all into one and do one giant haul. Yes. So that's what we're doing today. I do think that we each, um, You'll kind of tell our favorite things as we go through this haul. We kind of definitely uh, picked up more of what each of us individually Listen, likes. Vera Bradley came for us personally. With this hundredth with collection. With this hundredth collection. So far. Yes. Okay? Seriously. All. <laughs> all of our favorite things, like, It was a personal, package. targeted attack. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> they wanted us to get one of everything, so we applied. Yeah. <laughs> So we are doing two hauls into one. The first one we are going to do is the Snow White collection, or actually it's the Disney 100th collection. Um, they did a little tiny Snow White capsule that released with the main pattern, which yes. if you don't know what we're talking about, I'll put a little uh, swatch. swatch of the pattern here. Mm -hmm. um, so you can kind of see what it looked like. Yes. So this has all of the collections uh, that represent, I guess, Disney 100, it's at like least in Vera's eyes. Yeah, different iconic characters from different eras. Different movies. Like um, and they are all in one pattern, which is super cool. It's yeah. like a mixed pattern of different movies and characters. Um, and we have come to find out since then that each of these little capsules is going to be released individually. Yeah. Because up to this point they have done Snow White, which was in tandem with the main pattern. Then there's been Winnie the, uh, Winnie the Pooh, and there has been Alice, Alice in, in Wonderland. Wonderland. We will not be purchasing any of the Alice in Wonderland collection. As you guys know, we aren't the biggest Alice fans. Yeah. Um, it's just not our vibe, not our cup of tea. And that's okay. Oh, <laughs> and that's okay. That's, that's totally fine. Yes. So, but we did have to pick up some of the pieces of the prior two collections. Yeah. So that's where we, where we are at. So we are going to dive into the haul, starting with the um, Snow White pieces, or I'll start with those, yeah. and then we'll just kind of mix everything yeah. in as we go. So, here we go. Without further ado, the first piece and one of the biggest pieces yes. of this entire haul Cute. is the Market Tote. You guys, we are obsessed with the Market Totes. Oh, yeah. Our family uses so many of these. They're so handy dandy for They everything. last forever. Yeah. Like, we have one that I'm pretty sure is like eight or nine years old at this point, and we are not easy on them either. No. And we throw it's them still around. We use strong. them for groceries. We use them for like postal packages. We use them for everything. And a lot of them just stay in the back of the car, and they're there when we need them. So when I saw that they had this one, which is actually the perfect mix of all collections together, we decided to pick it up. And my girl Snow is in her full glory on this bag, so I picked it up. So this is the main Disney 100th pattern. Yes. Uh, this is what all of the, the Disney 100 pieces come cool. in. So you can see there's Pooh and Piglet up here, there's Snow White, Bambi and Thumper, Alice, Peter Pan is over here. So there's like different In like a ditzy kind of floral. Yeah. And um, it's really fun because not only did they do the main characters from these films, but they also sprinkled in yeah. some side characters. They sprinkled in some little like fun accents that relate to those characters. So here is the Market Tote. So if you're unfamiliar with the Vera Bradley Market Totes, they are like this slicky uh, plastic material. You can wipe them down. They are great for hauling things because they have these really sturdy straps on them. These are black because it kind of matches the pattern. And then you have the main pattern here on the side. And then check out these little icons. So there's honey pots and there's uh, pickaxes, there's apples. Mad Hatter's hat. Mad Hatter's hat. And the pocket So watch. amazing. Look at the little bird from Snow White. I just love the like trail of pixie dust. So, so, so cute. And my personal favorite feature of the Market Totes are the little pockets on the side. So they come with this little pocket where you can put your receipts while you're shopping or you can just put little things that tend to get lost. 
and then there it says Disney and Vera Bradley with the little pixie dust. So this is the Market Tote. The collection or this uh, pattern is called Classics on the Green, which is really cute. And um, this it's is a what weird because it's not green, but like on the green. It's a oh, reference to a prior Vera Bradley yeah, print from like years yeah. and years ago. It was called Tavern on the Green. So this is it to like mimic that, but with characters. I think so. Okay. I mean, it's sense. kind of like a, a conspiracy theory that I just made up, but I think that's what it is. Um, and so that's why it's called mm -hmm. that, even though it's so interesting because technically the collection is called Disney 100, but then yeah. each pattern has its own name, which is normal. But the pattern name doesn't really have anything to do with the collection name, so it's kind of interesting. Yeah. But I was going to show you guys what this tag looks like because it's they really outdid themselves with the tag here. So it says Disney, Vera Bradley, in like this holographic font. And then here is the Disney 100. So it gives a little bit of detail about the collaboration and what they're celebrating with this collection. And this is the market. So, okay, the thing about the Winnie the Pooh collection is the minute I saw them announce it, I was like, oh no. I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Mm -hmm. And I was right. Mm -hmm. I was in trouble. Mm -hmm. And I bought more things than I should have, probably. But also, I'm not sad about it. <laughs> I'm not there mad. rarely comes a pattern that has been so fit for Abby when it comes yeah. to the Disney collaborations. The, the only one that I can think of that was semi-close semi was the flirty floral, and that was because it was purple. Yeah. But the characters, the theming, whatever, wasn't super up your alley. I liked the Beauty and the Beast one, but the collection itself was so small, and I wasn't and it was the very biggest like fan. high-end elegance, which... This one's much more, more, more my cozy, on the ground. cozy yes. alley. Yes. Uh, so, the, one of the things that I, I had to get when I saw this in person... Look at it! <laughs> is the throw pillow. Are you kidding me? Oh Look at that. It's so fluffy. It's so cozy and fluffy and wonderful and so soft. You can't obviously see that because it's in the plastic still. Cause I don't want to take it out of the plastic till I'm like ready to use it because mm -hmm. it'll stay. Nice it's a crazy amount of pillows on um, them, so. I do. You have to cycle them through. I Although, do. I will say this, if you hold it up, the colors and everything, perfect for spring and summer. So, so this is the gorgeous. season to use this throw pillow. Yes. Mm -hmm. I love the colors in this collection too. So very much in love. Yes. And this, I believe, is called the Decorative Throw Pillow. Yeah, Decorative Throw Pillow. And the pattern is... Disney Winnie the Pooh. On the nips. Pretty straightforward. <laughs> I like it. And I will say that one of the cool things about the Vera Bradley Throw uh, Pillows that was the same with the Ariel collection as well is that there is a zipper compartment oh. on the bottom. This zips open. And then you can take the case off, wash it, and then put it back on your pillow. Nice, which right? so many throw pillows, specifically Disney-related throw pillows, they don't. do not have that. And it drives me nuts because I'm like, if you want to use this pillow, if you want other people to use this pillow, you want to be able to wash it. So... Great point. So cute, and I love it. <laughs> I would also like to mention that I showed extreme restraint with the Snow White collection because I could have easily gotten one of everything. I just loved it so much. But as we've known, as we like look through these other collections that they're releasing, they made very little pieces with just snow on them yeah. compared to like the Winnie the Pooh pieces that were made and even the Alice pieces that were made. Um, they released snow within the 100th collection so there were how many pieces maybe eight it wasn't nearly as much maybe five as to eight others. that were just snow related so i didn't have as many things to choose from <laughs> i'm not complaining but i'm just saying it allowed me to show more restraint because i didn't love a lot of the styles that came out the one piece that i saw instantly and was like that has yeah. to be mine she very much was like that's yeah. mine. Yes, and it looks, it's just perfection. Everything about it is perfection, and it is the cosmetic bag. So this one is a faux leather black cosmetic bag, and then it has the screen printing of Snow White and her friends on the front. So I just think they did Snow White so well with this. Mm -hmm. So and she be, looks so cute and yeah, adorable. And really like does. Snow White can be very hit or miss just because I feel like the original isn't that detailed. So people yeah. can either go, they just it's really cute or it looks right. really weird. <laughs> yeah. But she looks so cute. Which I will look. say some of the pieces in this collection, the ones specifically that were embroidered that she was like 3D, I felt like her face wasn't great. It did kind of give me creepy like knockoff vibes. Um, just because, again, her face is kind of hard to get because she's so... Old. Yeah, <laughs> but um, this one the screen printing I thought was just so cute. hit the nail on the head amazing So that's why I got this. It's the whimsy cosmetic in Disney Snow White and here is what the front looks like 
So as you can see, Snow White is dancing in her ball gown there on the front, looking gorgeous. And then she is playing with her little woodland creatures. There's a bunny there, and then you have like the berries and the woods, um, like the florals from the woods kind of around her. And then this is the Whimsy Cosmetics, so it does have a little handle here on the top. And then it zips open this way and you can open it up and it has a plastic lining on the inside, which is awesome. So you feel like you can truly use it for cosmetics and not have to worry about things spilling, spilling or messing up your bag. So there's a little mesh pocket there on the top. And then this is what the inside looks like. Look again how cute that inside lining is. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. So this is the Whimsy Cosmetic. I do think this would make a really cute bag if you wanted to carry it on your own as well. Like you could do uh, this as like a little evening bag or you could maybe attach a strap to it, wear it as a crossbody. So many cute options. And it has the same uh, Disney 100 tag on it as well. We just do a, another little zoom up on her face. Look how good her face looks. Ah, oh, I love it. There's few things in my collection that I feel like Snow White's face looks this Excellent. Yeah. And shockingly, that's all I have from Snow White. I did get a few pieces from the Winnie the Pooh launch as well, but again, good job me with the soft control. I didn't have any, so at least one last <laughs> Again, as I was saying, I think had they had a launch for snow like you had, they had for you, oh, we would have been. In I would have had it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next thing I picked up, I'm so excited about, and I wasn't really sure I was gonna get this, and then I saw it in person, and I was like, yeah, I'm gonna need to, I'm gonna need to have it. Um, and it's the tumbler. I cup, love this color. The double wall tumbler Obsessed. with straw in Disney Winnie the Pooh, and it's so cute. I love the color of this collection. But we've got Tigger. We've got. We're gonna keep scrolling around. Pooh, and I think. Piglet is next to Pooh. You can't really see him because the sticker is directly right on his face. in the way. But I love this, and we love our Vera Bradley tumblers mm -hmm. around here. We, we use quite them a few. all of the time. Yep. So I just, I love the little purple honey pots and the flowers. I'm just obsessed with this whole pattern and the little bees. It's just, it's, it's so cute. You guys know that we are always here pushing for hydration. Hydrate, kids. Get yourself a cute tumbler that makes you want to use it, makes you want to drink water. And we might, I can try to peel the sticker yeah, and actually see, if, see if we can see Pooh's face. We wanted it to look pretty when we showed it to you guys, but now we can take it off. What's the pattern name on the Snow White cosmetic? You said Disney Snow White. So maybe they're so, just all called Disney, Disney, whatever. So character. maybe, yeah, Disney the Alice, individual Disney things Disney are Disney, yeah. Alice in Wonderland, Disney Winnie the Pooh, Disney Snow White, but then the ones with all of them is the Disney well, on the characters green, on the characters green. on the green. Disney classics on classics the green. on the green. Excuse me. I did look it up. Again. Does that mean we're gonna get a different pattern with like more recent movies? I don't know. That would be awesome though. Because these are all classic films, so maybe we'll get I like Frozen. A Frozen Moana. I want Anna and Elsa. I want Rapunzel. Rapunzel. That kind I of want. That would be so what else fun. do we want? Zootopia. Did you see Nick and Judy? That would be so cute. We're throwing these ideas out there. Right? You're welcome to use them. Anyway. <laughs> So there's Pooh and Piglet. You can see them better now that I pulled all the stickers off. Aren't they so cute? They're so cute. I love them so much. And here's Tigger. Hee! <laughs> I love it. It's really I love cute. It. And I love say how many ounces it is? Uh, 24, I think it said. Yeah, 24 ounces. So it's a pretty good amount. Yeah, it's great. Okay, next. next up. You guys have heard from me before that this is one of my favorite styles. I have it in a lot of different patterns, but I use it as my everyday wallet all year round and I just switch them out for the seasons. So I'm, I'm never mad about getting another one because I do feel like I use them. And I do a lot of them like to keep them looking good. So I don't want to wear them into the ground because <laughs> then I can't, I can't collect them. So if you're, if y'all are collectors out there, you feel me. So I decided to pick up this little beauty from the Winnie the Pooh collection and it is the little zip ID. And the main thing that like spoke to me that I had to pick this up is because it doesn't have Pooh on it, it has Piglet. And again, I love that they included the sidekick characters. Yes. There were some pieces that had Tigger, some pieces that had Rue, Eeyore, Piglet, and then of course Pooh. And I just thought that this was 
precious. So this one is fully embroidered on the front, so it does add a little bit more stability to it, which is nice. Here is what it looks like. So this is the Zip ID case in Winnie the Pooh, but it has Piglet on the front, and he's like chasing the bumblebee. And then you have the little honey pot down here. Again, it's embroidered on the front, so it's a really, really pretty texture. And then this has the same inside print as the Snow White pieces, but I tried to pick my placement here, so I have the little honey pots there and the um, the pocket watch. pocket watch, thank you, from the White Rabbit. But I really just was looking for the honey pots and the bee to kind of go with the theme. And then this is what the inside looks like. So again, same inside pattern. And then with the zip IDs, there are two pockets. So there's one that has the ID window, so you can kind of organize your cards with that, and then the main pocket as well. Super, super cute. Again, I'm obsessed with this color. Mm -hmm. Excellent color choice on Vera's part for this Winnie the Pooh collection, because I just love the, like, the teal color. This one's giving Piglet's big movie energy. Yes! And I'm here for it. With a few good friends and a stick or two, a house is built at a Kona Cult. That movie's if 20 you know. <laughs> years old this year. Can you believe that? No, I can't. I we grew up on that film. That. What's happening? <laughs> and yeah, literally, I think we watched that film more than like any other 100 Year Boy oh, collection. Yeah. Because yeah. it's just so iconic. It's so iconic. Piglet's anyway. my favorite. The music is great. It's it's great. It okay. talks about building character. Yeah, and I mean, friendship. we were talking about like, friendship. We were talking about no friend left behind. So it's great. Anyway. You should go watch it if you haven't. <laughs> Piglet's big movie. I think it's on Disney Plus. You should watch it. Anyway, next thing we have to show you is this, which is just so cute. It's the dish towel. And uh, it's another one of those that we weren't really thinking we were going to get it. And then yeah. we walked in and we were like, because yes. look at his little face. Eating the honey. Are you kidding me? <laughs> He's so cute. It's so cute. And full disclosure, we did buy two of these because we needed one for the kitchen and one for the bathroom. Yes. Yes, we did. No shame in my Worth game. Worth it, though. Not no to shame. mention when we're old and gray and our new we, matching yeah, towels. Yeah. 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 When we live together, like the spinster, <laughs> spinster grandmas were going to be. I was thinking... <laughs> Yeah. Like that old uh, spinster couple in Murder, She Wrote. Yeah. Just not murder. The spinster sisters. But they didn't murder them. They did Spoiler murder. Alert. Didn't murder them. Mr. Penroy's Vacation. Great episode. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> iconic. All right. Oh, anyway. Man. So okay. that's, yeah, that's me. <laughs> Moving on. Okay, my final piece to share in this collection, I... Again, was fully not anticipating <laughs> buying this when it's we, running when we, was going, like, clearly. we were like, we're going to be fine. We're, we're not going to buy anything. that much. And then we bought a little of it. But again, this piece, it spoke to me because of how fantastic the design is. Yeah. And the fact that I, I could come up with a million and one uses for it. I was like, okay, this has to happen. And it is the Whimsy Cosmetic in the Winnie the Pooh collection. It's hot. It's hot. It's a teal honey pot. I love it. With embroidery, with poo, and this is officially the Winnie the Pooh cosmetic in Disney Winnie the Pooh. Straightforward. There you go. Okay. But basically it is the Whimsy Cosmetic, very similar to the one I got for Snow White. And I do intend to use the Snow One for cosmetics, like when I travel. This one I'm thinking is more of like an organizer that yeah. I'm gonna use at home mostly because I don't know how functional it is to put it into a suitcase, but it's just so amazing. Cute. It's just amazing. So here is the little honey pot. There is a handle on the top so you can carry it. And then look at this embroidery. So it says honey and these um, 3D embroidered letters. And then look at Pooh. He's so cute. So there's the little flowers that he's sitting on, the bumblebee. And then here is what the back looks like. Amazing job with the stitching on the side. So it truly is like a round sphere cosmetic, but it does sit up on its own because the bottom is flat. And then here's what it looks like in Side. So it is the same pattern as with the other collections, but this one does not have a plastic lining. It's actually kind of plush. So here is what the inside is. There are no pockets or anything. It's just a round 
sphere of wonder and I really do think it would be so cute for storage and then like on a shelf mm -hmm. it actually would work as a decoration uh, as a decor piece as well as a functional organization I have to say I'm really loving that Vera Bradley is like branching into these like shaped cosmetics yes, we have the clam different. shell with Little Mermaid mm -hmm. we have the honey pot with Winnie the Pooh I'm yeah. obsessed with it. it's amazing I love so it so great <laughs> and the final thing the big thing you know we didn't actually get any bags other than we the did. cosmetics <laughs> Which, although I technically have always been like an accessories girl, like yeah. I'm always drawn to the little tchotchke -y things. That's true. And you're just drawn to cozy in general. I am. I, I did get the slippers, but I've been wearing them so they're already worn. <laughs> she dare not show you because she's been wearing them for a while now. But yeah, we'll just they're so cute though. They're, like they still, they're adorable. They're still cute. They Again, make them smile. They're I think so that was maybe the one thing or one of two things yeah. that you walked in I, knowing that you were when I get. I had I heard they had slippers. I was like, I need the slippers. Because I think I we've mentioned before, the, Abby's obsessed uh, with the with snoozy slippers. slippers. Mm -hmm. My favorite. I wear them all the time. Yeah. Hope can attest. Yes. All the time. All the time. <laughs> anyway, but this I actually had almost talked myself out of, and then I saw it in person, and I was like, no, yeah, I'm yeah, need to. Because I don't need another throw blanket, but also I need another Look throw blanket. Look how vivid these colors are. It Did is you see that? so plush and wonderful. And, and again, Beer Bradley throw blankets, 10 out They're of 10. They're the best. If you've never had one, you need to try Which it. Which is why I was not going to have this one, because I have too many. Yeah. But it. I, but again, seasons. Like, you can rotate yeah. them out. Yeah. And um, I do feel like this one is a very contrast of colors to the others that you have. Yeah, so that's true. Like I, don't darker, have, I don't really colors. have blue like this. I have a dark blue from mm -hmm. Beauty and the Beast, the Beauty and but the Beast, yeah. this one's a lighter, like, yeah. springtime blue. What struck me, what sold me on it, was the amount of characters mm -hmm. that they put on this blanket. Totally unexpected. was yeah. not expected because a lot of the other Disney collections, it's been like one, maybe two yeah. characters, and this one has like the whole gang practically, yeah. and I'm obsessed with it. Up here at the top, or I guess so in the middle. Flowers. Flowers. The top. Beautiful. Really beautiful flowers. Kind of like carnations. Yeah. And then you go down, and there's Pooh and Piglet. Are we in the frame? I can't. Yes. Tell. Okay. So cute. And then we're gonna we're gonna like fold it down a little bit. Over here, Tigger. Look. Look at him. And Roo. Ah! They're doing the the hoop de doopter loop de looper alley oop for bounce. bounce. And Tigger then... really should also see. <laughs> anyway. With Winnie the Pooh watch list, list playlist just for down you. below that you guys need to see if you haven't already. And then, Although you guys are our people, so you probably have. Then at the very bottom, Eeyore is here too, and he has his tail. Look at him; he's so cute. I just, I was like, yeah. And okay. look, again, these colors are and the gorgeous. The flowers the teal, are the pink, so the pops of lime green. Pretty. I just, and I, I love. love it so wait, hold on again. These blue flowers are beautiful. Those are my favorite. Yeah. With like the powdery blue. So pretty. So, so pretty. And I was like, okay, yeah, this Amazing. is Amazing. Cool. It's coming. I can't, I can't even help it. Yeah. Yeah. It's just yeah. amazing. Meant to be. And now you have the blanket and the yeah. pillow that match. It's going to be so cute. Aren't you matching? I'm so excited. <laughs> so, as you can see, imagination works the best when it's set free. <laughs> <laughs> Reference my other fave. I, don't know, out I, for a I just pattern. can't say, as you can see, without leading into the rest of it. So, as you can see, this was a, kind of a mid-sized haul. I actually yeah. do think we could have bought more. Yeah. So, you know, we'll, we'll pat ourselves on the back for yeah. that. That's all right. We, we did okay. Um, but... Vera Bradley needs to stop making all of our favorite characters in patterns because that's okay. Be that's okay. That's okay. Because I think there's going to be Alice in Wonderland. There's probably going to yes. be Peter Pan. I can I can hold out on those. So that's it for this video. We apologize for it being a little bit delayed. We usually try to be more on it with the hauls. However, life's been a little bit crazy, yeah. and so we just have not had the time to do this haul. But we hope that you enjoy, enjoyed it regardless. And if you liked it. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe down below for more Disney magic and let us know in a comment which of these items that we hauled is your favorite. And also let us know which of these collections, like characters, are your favorite. Snow White, Winnie the Pooh, Peter Pan, Alice in Wonderland, and Bambi. Bambi. Those are the five like things that are in yep. this pattern. So let us know which one's your favorite and we'll see you next time.